Hey guys, thanks for joining us again for another Duplin Winery Dine and Wine Wednesday. Frank here, and today we're going to show you exactly how we make our sweeters. Now what our sweeters are, they're a wine slushy, and we've got a bunch of different flavors. I've got a chocolatini here, we got a berry bliss, uh, what else we got, margarita, a raspberry mango lemonade, but there's about 10 different flavors of these, and you can make them at home, and I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing you need, you need a blender. Now you can use any blender you want, but the Ninja blenders work the best, but if you got a $20 blender like I've got at the house, I usually go buy my ice at the store. It's a little bit easier to crush up. Or if you've got a, a refrigerator that you have an ice crusher on it, use that ice, because that works really good on the cheaper blenders. But if you got a Ninja blender, they work great. Best thing to use though, is if you got a margarita machine. Those work awesome. I mean, it makes it, it's almost like, it's just so fine with that. But here's how you make them. We've got a pitcher full of ice here. We're gonna take one of the packets that come in the sweeters and we're gonna pour that over top. Now what this is, it looks like Kool-Aid. So it's gonna be a powder, you pour that over top. And like I said, there's two of those in here. So if you buy one of these, you get two in there, plus you buy the wine and you use half a bottle of wine. This one calls for Hatteras. We're gonna pour half that bottle of Hatteras over top here. So if you buy one of these, and one of the bottles of wine, you actually get two blenders full. Now, if you got kids that are under 21, you can actually make one for them that's non-alcoholic. What you use is our muscadine non-alcoholic wine. Do the same thing, half a bottle of that, one of those packets, mix that up. We do this with our niece a lot. Take them down to the lake. You have yours with the alcohol in it, theirs without it. When you want them to go to bed, just give them a little bit of yours. They'll go right to sleep. I'm just kidding, we don't do that, all right? We don't do that, I promise. So now we've got our blender full of ice, our mix, and our wine. We're gonna push that on top there, and we gotta grab the top of our Ninja blender here. We're gonna throw that on top. Bring it up. It's gonna be a little bit loud, but that's okay. This is gonna be so good when you get done. Give it just a couple seconds there. Just want to make sure that gets really, really ground up. That should do it. Now, if you've ever had fudge sickles, this really reminds me of fudge sickle ground up. It's really good. So we're going to take the top, pour that in a glass. Oh man, that looks good. And if you think you got too much ice in there, a little bit, you know, they're too thick, just keep blending up a little more until you get it the consistency you want. But that is our chocolatini. Let's taste it. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Now, it tastes just like a fudge sickle. Those things are awesome. Now, here's something else I've done with these. If you take the Berry Bliss and do half of the Berry Bliss and half of one of the chocolatinis, it kind of tastes like a uh, chocolate-covered strawberry. So, if you're doing these around Valentine's Day, that's a good little Valentine's thing to do for your uh, significant other. So, but yeah, try these out. You can come down here, buy them here at the retail room, or you can get them online. Or if you're out, we do have um, some of our little boutiques in the area who sell these. Check those out, buy one there. But guys, thanks for joining us again. You guys stay safe. We'll see you on the other side. This is Frank, out.